That's right. But out here tonight, Buna was taking on a die ball lumberjack team that had plenty of size that knocked them off last year, 50 to two. And Bradley Morgan leading his troops into battle. One of the nicest guys you'll ever meet in Southeast Texas. One of the longest tenured coaches we have around here in the 409. And we're going to pick things up here. Opening quarter action. That's Jalen Jackson going 23 yards. The extra point was no good after a bobbled snap, but it was 6 nothing Lumberjacks. But wait, there's more. The toss going out to Jalen McMillan, who's going to air it out to Jalen Willis. Half back pass. 13 nothing at this point. More from the Lumberjacks later. But right now, Buna. How about this? Jacob Menard. He's in there. And all of a sudden, it's 13 to 6. You're feeling a little mo. Starting to switch on the Buna side. They're going to talk things over. And hey, let's roll the dice. Let's go for two. And it's going to pay off. Menard is in there. And it's a 13 8 ball game. But things are starting to get out of hand here just before the half. Dylan Gravenino is going to be picked off by mm. McMillan. And he's got himself a chance for six, but right here it gets taken down. Great effort there by Graffinino, the quarterback, is who came down to get him. But die ball just too much. Going end zone, and Cale Knox is there on the other end. Touchdown, and they roll over Buna. Your final was 59 to 22. And Nothing to be ashamed about for Buna. Nothing to Nothing be ashamed of. When you looked into this game this year, okay, Die Ball was a top 10 team all of last year. They went on the road, knocked off Jasper after Amelda last season. We were up there for that one. That was a crazy one. And, you know, Die Ball lost a ton, but they still have so much size. And that's what our area is blessed with speed. Lots we have it. tons of speed all over the place. We have some great skill players, and we have some great DBs and, and you know, a few linebackers. Our area has always lacked size, like at least since, you know, I mean, I've been doing this 20 years. When I saw Carthage, that was yeah. insane. Yeah, the that size, was insane. when you get up into East Texas, every team across the state, different regions have their different strengths. Region 3, we have speed for days out here. Titan tempo. You get up there to East Texas, though, you're starting to get big boys. Oh, yeah, the Lumberjacks are named Lumberjacks because they really are <laughs> Lumberjacks. They they go out there and, you know, chop down wood all day. You think it's like Rocky, Rocky IV? You know, Probably out there so. In the I mean, yeah. Coach Morrison yeah. up there, uh, he, he's been a local coach here in yeah. Orangefield before. He's been around for a long time as well. Great guy. Uh, he's got those guys rolling just at the right time. That's all that matters. He got to the yeah. dance. Now you got to party and see how far you can go. Unfortunately, it ends for Buna tonight. Great season out of the Cougars. But you know what? They 